My name is Erin Doyle and I'm a junior in the Movement Science major. Prior to classes starting this fall, um, I came in a few days early just to catch up with some professors and I was talking to Dr. Kakalis about um, the new Phys of X professor, Dr. Salasinski, and he told me all about the research that she was doing and I was immediately interested. So then I knocked on her door and we started talking about it and she asked me to join her and I was ecstatic. The research project that we are doing um, is looking at the effects of water aerobics on breast cancer survivors and their caregivers. What really inspired this research is looking for a way for individuals who were diagnosed with breast cancer or caregivers who are taking care of someone with breast cancer, a mechanism for them to increase their quality of life, how they feel about themselves, something that they can do for themselves in a time when everything is out of their control once they're diagnosed. So this is something that they can do for themselves, something that they can do to decrease their risk of cancer reoccurrence and to make themselves feel better. We found that the participants have felt that they've increased their overall health, they've increased their flexibility, their range of motion. More importantly, it's become a way of life for most of them. Despite their condition, they are so happy and loving. It's really cool to see how exercise is now such an integral part of their life. We had someone who was sick and couldn't get in the pool and she brought her own weights and sat at the pool and was doing the exercises. When I was talking to her, she said, well, it's part of my life now and I didn't want to miss it. That's you know, one of the most rewarding things that could come out of this research. It's exciting to watch a student transform when the information finally clicks for them and they start learning the information with passion. It really reminds me that what I'm studying is applicable to real life. This past fall we presented at the Kirka um, presentation at campus and then next fall 2019 we hope to present at the New England American College of Sports Medicine convention. When my students are able to understand and explain it to someone so they understand and make the lifestyle changes, that is what really gets me excited about teaching.